Shalom, this is Sister Lydia and I'm from the Royal Jewels team. Today I'll be showing you all a fun and super easy DIY and I'm super excited for you all to see this video today. It's time that it's come out. Hope you all enjoy it. Maybe one day you can redo this DIY for yourself at your home. So for those of you who have a small bathroom and a small bedroom like myself, this DIY may be helpful for you. And if you would like to redo the DIY, please send in your videos, please send in your pictures to my Royal Jewels Facebook page comment down below if you have any comments any feedback for us and if you like to see more DIYs more fashion more lookbooks more modesty you know where to come my royal jewels stay tuned hope you all enjoy as you all can see this is my bathroom and it's pretty small like I stated before if you stick around I'm going to show you how I went about my DIY candlelight decor stay tuned These are some old plates my mom gave me, so I use them as a centerpiece. You can't move it. You can't I thought this candle was pretty cool, so I picked it up from Dollar Tree as well. You can't take it. This is one of my hand soaps I picked up a while back from Roses. I love the color scheme of it and the smell was green apple. So to my surprise, I picked one up from Dollar Tree, which was only a dollar. You can't move it. You can't shake it, you can't beat it, you can't take it, it's unchanging, it's unchanging, it ain't changing, it ain't changing, so find your love, find your friend, better one you know that you need them, yeah. Here's an old candle jar that I don't use anymore, so all I did was recycle the lid and use it as a placement to place my oil on. It ain't changing, heavy love is all. So as you saw before, I did the same exact thing as the green apple candle. So as you can see, I did the same decor piece as I did in my bathroom, but now it's on my desk area. All I did was got a bigger size frame, add in my favorite candles, and add an old diffuser that I picked up from Family Dollar. There you have it. These are some pretty cool flowers that I picked up from Dollar Tree, which were only a dollar. I thought they were very pretty, so I decided to add them to my decor. Here's an old book shift Sister Maria made back in middle school. She decided to give it to me as a great gift when I went away from college. So I have some things I like to use for my candles. I have notebooks up here. I have these cool notepads, Israelite 2016. These pretty cool notebooks I like to use to keep my precepts in, pertaining to women, when I get counsel, any cool YouTube ideas I like to jot down. They were only a dollar for all three. So I like to keep them and they come in handy. You can't shake it, you can't beat it, you can't take it, it's unchanging, it's unchanging, it ain't changing, it ain't changing. So I recycled another candle lid jar and I used it to place my hand sanitizer on, my handy dandy flash drive, and another recycled candle lid jar to place coins, pins, and safety pins in just to keep on hand by my desk. So for the final look I used this Woodcraft Lavender Scented Candle, as you can see I'll be using two, and I got these from Dollar Tree which was also a dollar which is awesome. So I love this decor because it's pretty simple, use some seashells to give it a really calm look, and yeah that's all to it. It's a look, so amazing, it ain't moving,
enjoyed this DIY candlelight decor if you do give us a thumbs up and also subscribe to our channel for more future DIYs check out myrealjewels.com looking for jewelry what about a scarf we got you. Don't worry. Check out our social media accounts and don't forget about our wonderful team. See you there. MyRoyalJewels.com.